Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Peachy and this channel is all about my Sylvanian Families collection. I wanted to do a resident update video today. It's been a little while since I did the villager introduction um, series where I was introducing you to all of my different villagers and I've acquired a few more residents since then so I wanted to introduce them to you. So first up here are these eight little cuties and these are the baby blind bag series, uh, the treat series. Um, there's a video up on my channel where I was unbagging a few of these um, but since then I've managed to complete the whole set. I just couldn't resist this set, they were so cute with all of their little sweet treats. So I ended up getting them all. So we have a marshmallow mouse, sandy cat, koala, snow bunny, uh, splashy otter, Osborne Bear, um, Little Deer and Little Panda. I'm sorry, I don't know the family names for the Koala, the Deer and the Panda. I think it might be maybe Pookie Panda, but I'm not sure on the, the Deer and Koala. But they are absolutely adorable. And then I have one other baby blind bag series edition and this is this little maple cat kitten um, and she came with like a bouquet of flowers um, I can't remember which series it might have been the birthday treat series um, sometimes uh, my partner just gives me random ones when I've been having a bad day to open they must have a stash of them somewhere or something but yeah she was when I was having a bad day um, I opened this one and got her so that's always a great way to cheer up so yes, these are my new baby editions from the Blind Bag uh, series. Then I have some new editions from the Town series. So first of all, I've got this uh, Marshmallow Mouse older sister and she came from one of the fashion play sets. And I've got her here in an outfit with her little shawl and her little umbrella accessory. Um, she's a Marshmallow Mouse and I just really love the pastel coloured clothing that she had and I think her dress is super pretty. So she's a new addition. And then also from the town series I've got Lionel, I think his name is Lionel Grand. Um, and he's the piano player and you can see he's got a special mould of hand um, for playing the piano. So his paws are specially moulded so it looks like he's playing the keys. And then also from that little town music set, I've got the Go Lightly cat sister who plays the cello. And again, she's wearing a super pretty dress. So this is the normal sister size, not the older sister size. And she's again got specially moulded hands for holding her cello and her bow. And then I also have Freya Chocolate in another absolutely stunning dress. And she has, again, specially moulded hands and she plays the violin. So I think those three together are the concert, are the Town Series concert set. And they each came with their respective instruments. And then I also have, I haven't got this one out of the box yet, but I also have um, the Flower Gifts play set with this Periwinkle Rabbit older sister and she comes with some um, flower accessories, a bouquet and a box of flowers and things like that. She's very cute, I love the lacy bow detail on her ear and I love the colour of her dress. Uh, her name is Catherine, she means Catherine Periwinkle. And then I have this paramedic figure. Um, I'm not sure what the family name is, but he looks um, the same colour and kind of mould as Emily Nightingale, the nurse. So I'm guessing he's a Nightingale rabbit. Um, he's the brown bunny. Um, he came in the, I think it was called the paramedic and patient set. So the patient was a little bear gree bear brother. And then he came with like a little backpack, like a little first aid backpack. Um, I don't have that set but I got him in a bundle with the ambulance which I got second hand on eBay so yeah I'll show you that in a different video but that's um, how I came to get the paramedic. 
and then some other ones I haven't unboxed yet. I have the little Dale Sheep Baby, who's extremely cute. She comes with a little backpack and a little hat, like she's going to nursery. Um, and her name is Emma Dale, which is quite amusing if you're from the UK. Is there's a, there's a television, long-running television program called Emma Dale on TV. Um, so her name is obviously a pun on that. And then I also have the Hopping Easter set and this comes with a little baby snow bunny and some other Easter treats and surprises and this really cute Easter basket. I'm sure I will be using this set in an Easter display next year. And then also new in was the pony hair stylist. So her name is Serafina Mainly, I think that's her name. Um, I wasn't too sure on these ponies at first, but um, after seeing her kind of out of the box and up close on other people's channels, um, I decided I really like her. I like um, the profile. I don't know whether you can see it so well in the box, but they have quite a, they have a really cute profile. And she's going to be working in my beauty salon alongside um, Antonio Patches. That's Serafina mainly. I love the colour of her um, outfit and I like the purple streak in her hair. And then I also picked up the Husky Mother and Father set with the baby triplets. Um, I will be getting all of these out of the boxes at some point. I have, just haven't got around to it yet while I've been sorting out the rest of the Sylvanian room. But we'll get there. Um, I, I want to get the other Husky family members as well, but these are the only ones I have just at the moment. Um, I love the mother's dress with her shawl. It's so pretty and the father's fluffy top looks really soft. Also the baby triplets are so cute. They're so tiny. That's the, the Husky family. And then I've got a few uh, special edition ones um, from the Sylvanian family's uh, website. So first up I have these raincoat babies, which I just couldn't resist. They, they look like a little rainbow. They're so cute. Um, so we've got Chocolate Rabbit, again the deer whose name, whose family name I can't remember. Little Maple Cat, a toy poodle, cake bread toy poodle, little koala, periwinkle, rabbit, and a marshmallow mouse. I just absolutely love that they come with these little rain boots as well. And they're kind of perfect for England because it's always rainy here at some point or another. So they will fit in very well. And then I also got the fairy tale friends. And these were really special because I won these in a competition um, on the Sylvanian families. Uh, Instagram page I think it was there was like a photo competition and I didn't win I was like one of the runners-up but this was the runner-up prize which I was more than happy with so we've got a little bubble brook elephant um, red panda koala again and I think this is a Keats cat um, the little red deer who again his family name I can't remember um, a little mouse I'm not sure of the family name on that one and this one looks like a wildwood bunny these are really cute, they look like the Seven Dwarfs. They're gonna be really good in a, in a scene at Christmas. Um, I really like the packaging on these and the raincoat babies. So it's kind of like, I was umming and ahhing about whether I wanted to take them out of the packaging or maybe I'll take them out to put them on scenes and then actually display them in their packaging, if you get what I mean. So it'll be like a, almost like a little display box for them but I will be able to get them out. I just think the packaging is so pretty. And then last but not least, I have these two special Sylvanian Families Kitchen Japan Exclusive Chef and Waitress set. And these are the older edition, which are um, Cottontail Rabbits. Um, there's a newer edition they released that are Chocolate Rabbits, but these are the older ones. And they wear these adorable little uniforms and they um, go with, well, they were sold to go with the Sylvanian Families Kitchen restaurant which I have, so they will be working in there. I just think they're too cute. And I don't think these were ever released outside Japan, 
so again I was I mean worrying about whether I wanted to take them out of the box because they're quite rare but again I think ultimately I want to have them out on display and be able to pose them so I think they will come out of the box eventually and yeah that's all my new residents at this point in time I wanted to do a little update video before it got really out of hand and I had loads and loads and loads to do it felt like this was a manageable amount to kind of update you on and just keep that series up to date I hope you've enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again next time bye bye for now